am I the a-hole for checking on the baby, who had been crying for 15 minutes, after asking my husband to watch him. This happened just about an hour ago, and my husband, 42M, is feeling frustrated with me right now. I asked him if he could look after our baby, 3 months old, so I could take a shower. He agreed and took the baby right away. I took a few minutes in the bathroom to get everything ready, soaps, towel, washcloth, and other shower supplies. During the entire 15 minutes I was in the bathroom, the baby was crying intensely and seemed to be struggling to catch his breath. Concerned about why he was so upset for that long, I came out of the bathroom and found that my husband had moved the baby swing into the kitchen and left the baby there while he cooked at the stove. The baby looked visibly upset. I picked up his pacifier and tried to calm him down a bit, and my husband looked a bit annoyed that I was tending to the baby instead of continuing with my shower. I went to grab a clean bottle from the sink, planning to make a bottle and sit down with him to help him settle. My husband immediately reacted, saying I was interrupting his plan and taking over. He took over making the bottle himself, brought the baby into the living room, and began feeding him, telling me to go finish my shower. I couldn't understand why he hadn't simply fed the baby 15 minutes earlier. I went ahead with my shower, and when I came out, the baby was calm and content, and my husband was back at the stove, happily chatting with the baby. His mood had shifted back to normal. I decided to go to our room for a few minutes to gather my thoughts before talking to him. He came in and asked why I'd closed the door. I replied that I wasn't ready to talk at that moment and mentioned that I didn't appreciate his tone with me earlier. At this point, he got frustrated and said that I didn't need to step in when he was already handling the baby. The conversation became a bit tense, with raised voices, but neither of us said anything we regretted. In the end, I returned to the bedroom, and he finished cooking. Later, he came into the room, took his pillow, and went to the living room to sleep on the couch as a clear sign of his frustration. Once I got the baby settled and asleep, I took the pillow back to the bedroom and sent him a message, explaining that I wanted us to discuss this together because I didn't think I deserved his reaction for simply checking on our baby. So, Ida for stepping in when he hadn't yet fed the baby?